The East African Legislative Assembly has resumed its sittings in Arusha, Tanzania. The regional legislator first business of the new year was the presentation of a report on the findings of an audit of the ESC accounts for the financial year ending June 2018. The regional assembly has implicated the senior staff of the East African community in the alleged mismanagement of funds and irregular award of contracts. Procurement process in the EAC organs and institutions which continue to contravene procurement procedures. Furthermore, gross irregularities were noted in recruitment and award of short-term contracts, uh, contracts, a process that contravenes EAC staff rules and regulations. The Assembly has directed the EAC Secretariat to strictly implement the Assembly's recommendations so as to avoid more cases of mismanagement of funds. Management will also enter into contracts within reasonable time with, within the financial year and ensure that any contracted work is completed within the agreed time frame and planned procurement and contracts are source of fragrant abuse of processes and EAC resources. In the whole EAC institutions, projects and programs continue to face challenges of low absorption due to delayed or non-remittance of funds. The report cites irregular withdrawal funds from the general reserve of the community. The lawmakers now want the ESC Secretariat to put in place control measures to safeguard the reserves. Some of these withdrawals were made without an approval of the Council of Ministers. Though the report highlights several irregularities in the award of contracts and mismanagement of finances, it does not directly point to fraud and stealing as previously reported in previous financial years. The regularities denied EAC Secretariat an opportunity to receive quality services and subjected uh, the EAC Secretariat to risk in case of any dispute. The lawmakers identified several financial irregularities in the EAC Secretariat, ESC Civil Aviation and Security Oversight Agency Kasowa, based in Entebbe, Uganda, and the Assembly itself, among others. After the presentation of the audit report to the Regional Assembly, the regional lawmakers are expected to debate the report next week, and the Secretary General of the community, Liberat Mufumukeko, is expected to respond to some of the allegations. Jingo Francis, NTV, in Arusha, Tanzania.